Welcome back everybody to Let's Play Final Fantasy IV The After Years. Oh my god, it happened again. Are you serious, game? Are you serious? Yeah, I just stuck this crap on auto battle. Anyway, um, somebody was kind enough to send me a message saying the location of the ores in this chapter. So the ones I have missed so far, which was a lot, um, I've actually gone and backtracked to. So there was one in the bookcase in the Fame Arch, which was the only, like, bookcase I didn't look at, for crying out loud. Uh, there's one there. Uh, there's one in Hidden in a Piece of Armor in East Tower in the Dwarf's Hideout. Um, there's another one in down Downstairs in the Base in a Piece of Armor. I got that one, too. As well as the a dresser in the Infirmary. Not one of the bookcases things, the shelves, the, the dresser. And I got two of the ones in Tomra here. And I just farted. I don't know if you heard that. Hopefully they didn't pick up on the recording. And there's also one in the armor shop here I need to pick up. I decided not to get that one off screen because, well, I was right back here. Hooray! So that's like seven of them now, I think, right? Yeah. Okay. Next is, oh, there's one of the forgery, too, I know what I need to go get. Okay. Even though it was there. Very appropriate place to pick one up. So let's backtrack for there real quick. And since I know there's some in the sealed cave, we're going to procrastinate and do that first. And that way we can level up a bit for plot-related stuff and whatnot. Because you know nothing's going to happen until we forcibly move the plot. And my cat is, like, staring at me. She's in, like got that, like, wild look on her face. So is it in that fireplace or the other one? Okay, the crappy one. Not the one that's on fire. Yeah, she runs away. Okay, she's just being weird right now. No, I didn't want to... Nah. Why does this have to be tucked away in a corner so this happens? Oh yeah, by the way, the moon phase advanced while I was backtracking for that stuff. Alright, where is the damn sealed cave? Not the sealed cave. I want to go to the sealed cave first. Ugh. Oh, an idiot. You know, I'm really missing not having the map on screen like I do in DS. That kind of sucks. Alright, I'm gonna save. Back in slot 2, which is the save I made right before I started this. Okay, let's screw around. Hopefully there's no damage floors in here. I sincerely hope... Oh, goody! Thank the Lord! I might want to take auto battle off for of this crap. Haha, <laughs> you missed. Alright, I'm gonna band with... Um... These two dorks. Because I heard there's a band between these two. Hopefully... It takes forever to go off, though! Ah, Jesus Christ. Hopefully I selected the right things. Hooray! I did it! Alright, that is even more- Oh my- What? Alright, that is disturbing. Totally freaking disturbing. I've also heard... No. There's- I know there's one with, um... With Rydia. Which I think I gotta do the Black Magic for. This is the one I was trying to find off screen, um, beforehand, and I just couldn't get the right things in. Yeah, the, 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 the stupid dance and jive one apparently is somewhat random, which I think kind of sucks. Um, oh, I need to rearrange my spells. Did I already do that with her? Yes, I did. Um, because I kind of liked that heal I got that one time, because I don't have a dedicated white mage in the party. I mean, granted, I can do whatever the hell I just did with her for zero MP, which is awesome, but at the same time, it's kind of crappy. Hopefully I can find my way around here. Riddell, what are you doing? 
She's attacking a cardboard box. Hey! No! Oh, zombies! Great! Now, see, this is what sucks about having banned first. This is not, there's no easy way to just very, very quickly defend. So, that kind of sucks. You dance for me, love. It's probably what I'm gonna have to just have him do. Just dance over and over. But it's like such a crappy heal, though! Okay, that always doesn't cast fire. That kind of sucks then. I was hoping it would, because that's what it's been doing lately. I'm gonna kill this carrot right now. Not literally, guys, but... She's just being a very naughty kitty right now. And I don't appreciate it. Yeah, let's use some potions. Okay. And we get them for a reason. I am totally gonna get friggin' lost in this place. Alright, yeah, I remember this thing. Okay, apparently something I did cast Blink on the party. I didn't really get to see what it was because I was giving my cat the evil look because she's misbehaving again. Oh, cockatrice! You suck. Probably shouldn't be wasting as much MP with Rydia as I have been. But whatever. I got a bow and arrow. Can I please see if I can go through these walls? Thank you. No. Ah, oh, god damn it! Oh, don't get me wrong, I'm glad I'm getting levels here, but Jesus crap! Need a safe oh, game. Yeah, Bush. Oh, this is bullcrap right here. This is complete and utter bullcrap. Running out of MP, and I don't have Osmos. I am gonna set you guys on fire. You hit something. You do something interesting. Apparently, you do all sorts of things with this crazy jive, but whatever. Or maybe you don't get to do anything. What levels are the dorks at now? Well, not bad. Well, there's at least an ether for me. Okay, apparently I can jive things into piggies. Which is interesting. Where is that ore? I think I've made more progress off screen than I have on screen on this episode so far. I have to. Please tell me these chests aren't booby trapped. Weren't there six here in the original game? I can hear the stupid fire trucks. I'm sorry if they show up on the recording. Ah, oh, fine. You get a dagger now. Fine, Rydia. Works for me. Okay. Actually, you know what I'm gonna do? I am gonna use a tent. Because I have a bunch and I need some more MP and I just park it right on top of my ship. Good job! And maybe this time we'll actually, um, just scare the crap out of my cat. Unintentionally, as I'm trying to get comfortable here. Let's see what's here. Just in case I keep screwing up. Alright, so let's go back in. And, well, not go that way this time. The only problem with this place is it's such a freaking maze. I'm just like auto battling like, everything to death here. Alright, that's the save point I was looking for before, so I'm gonna save it again here. But I remembered about one of the secret passages that I missed the very first time I played through here, so. It's like. Like, whack my head against everything, because I'm trying to get comfortable in my chair here, and it's just not working today. Oh, back attack! No! Yeah, auto battle's working just fine for this crap. Alright, this is how it. Dang it, game! This is the first chest, right? Okay. Where is the damn ore? Love of crap! Let me find it, dang it! 
Another dagger, as if I needed that. Alright, I know there's one in the house, too, so... Um, which direction do I want to go in? I'll go this way. Oh, tiny mages, how I love you! <coughs> Sorry. Okay. Give me the damn orb! For crying out loud, where the hell is it? Oh, bombs. You know, we can use some magic for this baby. Why the heck not? Thank you, drive through. You know, I'm really missing the, uh... No, hey, you're not allowed to do that. Not allowed to do that. Please don't kill her. Thank you. Here, why don't you potion if I ready then? But um, I really like how in DS, um, analyze not only analyzes all enemies in battle, but your beast area info um stays the entire time, so you only have to analyze each enemy once, and you constantly have their HP amounts and stuff like that. I love that. Uh, what are Rowan's levels? Not there, too terrible. Okay, I need to get over there somehow. I'm missing those three chests. Wait, this is the way to the house, okay. So there's one path I haven't taken yet. Alright, so I got that. Same. Now, before in this, I step in this house, I'm, I'm curious about something. What happened to the Sylphs? Because we know what happened in the Fame Arch, but not all the Eidolons live in the Fame Arch. So are the Sylphs here? Have they been turned to stone as well? Like, like we don't know what Summon Rydia tried to call when she said they're not answering. And for that matter, one thing I actually thought of the other day is what the hell happened to Bahamut? Because you remember, he lived on the moon. Well, the moon isn't here anymore. Technically, um, you know, it kind of left 17 years ago. So where did Bahamut go? Did he stay there? Is he still being able to be summoned? Like, we know Barry Sue has him under her control. How, why, I have no, absolutely no idea. But I'm just curious, like, where the hell has he been? I mean, well, actually, he is summonable in Interlode, so he's either somewhere else or he can transcend or time and space, or I don't know. It's one of those things that just has me curious. Okay, so the cells are turned to stone. Just one. No, oh, poor babies. So at least that was addressed. Okay. There we go. Just optimizing the crap out of everybody. Alright, so this will take us out, right? Okay, so let's go back in a third time and get those last three chests. Because one of them has got to contain the aura missing! You know, the one I first came in here for. Now the question is, I must have to go through it on this staircase. Because I think this is the only one I haven't gone down yet. Yeah, because what I did was I went through the wall to get to the passage. So it's these three chests up here, right? Game, game! But I wouldn't give for a safe travel augment right about now. Please. The, where is the friggin' ore? Is there something else I'm missing? I could have sworn there was an ore in here. Where the crap hell bull mother is it? I'm missing something else. I know it. I know I am. It's just a matter of what. Um... I'm gonna cheat and look up a map of this place, and she is totally gonna die. Whatever. Um, so I can find what the heck I'm missing, because this place is a maze for crying out loud. I hate this place. This is why I hate this place, because it is such an annoying to navigate, and you gotta backtrack, and all that crap. So I'm gonna look up a map real quick, just to make sure I haven't missed anything or something, and I'll return shortly. Good news! I found the chest I needed! I actually remembered on my own where the hell it was. It was just a matter of uh, making my way there without getting attacked left and frickin' right. 
I'm just running from everything now because this is getting freaking ridiculous. Damn it! I'm sorry, I'm just annoyed because I... Like, every three steps I got attacked and it was annoying as crap. Alright, so... I'm not even going to bother using a tent right now. I'm going to save right here. How far am I up to, anyway? I haven't looked at my... Capture thing in a while. Okay. Actually, yeah, I'm going to stop it right here and we'll head off to the uh, Sylph Cave in the next episode. Not the Sylph Cave, the, the, the Sealed Cave. And I'm pushing the buttons in the wrong direction because my cat is attacking a receipt underneath my shoes that I have to kind of collect the sand from the winter. And she's just being very awkward right now. It's rather funny, actually. But anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Sorry this episode kind of was filled with um, any anger because I hate the self cave. I don't like it at all, but I'm done in there. I don't have to do anything else, so... Next time we'll advance the plot. See you later!